watching WSBT 22 News at 5. Well, today the Michigan Area Council of Governments officially unveiled its new line of inner urban trolleys, those buses that look like trolley cars. Yeah, the new models will, will replace the current aging fleet. WSBT 22's Ed Ernst just went along for a ride and has all the details. The new inner urban trolleys were officially unveiled near Concord Mall. MACOG, that oversees the trolley system, says they were built with many things in mind. They wanted to make sure not only did the trolleys look nice, but also was reliable and dependable and was uh, a better uh, kind of overall ride and feel. So these vehicles are tested to last for 12 years and 500,000 miles, which is uh, leaps and bounds above where we were with our previous buses. Another big change, the look and feel inside and out, along with improvements for riders. We wanted to preserve kind of the elegant feel of the trolley uh, on the exterior, but then offer modern passenger amenities on the inside. That includes an LED light system, a wheelchair ramp, more seating, a higher seat set up in the back and one lower step to get inside instead of several steps. Several longtime riders from the area who we talk to who depend on the trolley daily and have already ridden on it say they like what they see and say the comfort level is great. Shannon Porter, who rode the older trolleys to get to work, has been riding the new ones. There's a lot more seats, so no one's standing around, and uh, the back part of it, it's like it's really high, so I can like kind of kick my legs up a little bit. Vivian Smucker, who can't drive because of vision impairment, especially likes the one low step on the new model. And this makes it easier for um, not only wheelchair users, but uh, people who use walkers. And, you know, even for people like me, when I have four or five bags of groceries. Ed Ernstis, WSBT 22 News.